this is Shax here again and I'm going to show you today how to create pad, multi pad and drafted filleted pad. So mechanical design, part design, ok, select the sketch. First I'm going to show you how to create a pad. So select the sketch and create any profile which you require to be the padding to be done. Once you come out of the sketch make sure that your your sketch should be completely a closed figure otherwise the pad option won't work. Now click the pad and give any required dimension. Click OK. So the pad will be done. Now I'm going to show you the drafted filleted pad. So what you can do, I'm going to show you the drafted filleted pad on this side. Select the sketch and I'm going to create another sketch and I'm going to come out of the sketch. The same rule applies. The sketch should not be open. So select drafted filleted pad and select this face and give the length which you require and uh, give the degree. This degree will be the draft angle, the angle in which you need the drafting to be done and again this 5 and 5 and 5 whatever you require you can give 5 and 15 or whatever. Okay and once you give the preview you can see how it looks like and click OK. Okay here again you can see uh, some part of it has come out so if you want to do any kind of editing you, you have a specification tree over here and uh, you can see the pad 2 is the second padding which you have done and in this everything is editable as you can see the edge fillet 1 this edge fillet 1 is the uh, edge which is being perpendicular or normal towards this particular plane is the edge fillet 1 if you give or if you change anything over here and if you click OK you can see the change over here again in this edge fillet you can make the necessary changes or whatever you want okay so this is it now I'm going to show you the third one that is uh, multi pad so what you can do again select the plane and give the sketch and select if you double click the same tool will be selected again once you draw and complete it so give the multi section I mean the multi pad definition and select 1 5 10 and 15 and 5 or whatever you require see this is what you have you can do the padding simultaneously in different sketches which you cannot do in the normal padding option. This is it. So hope you like my video.